Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. Uh, before we talk about what is in the screen, uh, first of all, I'm really, I was very busy. This is why I'm not making videos. And I had a very bad cold in the same time. Uh, however, yesterday we have uh, a very nice seminar. And actually today, uh, you know, uh, we have a very, uh, very important meetings we were able to accomplish. Uh, maybe in later videos we can explain about it more. However, now I want to talk about this news. Uh, one of the Liverpool a Liverpool fan, he was screaming that if you make one more goal, I will convert to Islam. You know, I mean, sometimes I wonder how stupid a human being can be. And you know, when I was in in the like. Uh, Living in the Middle East, as you know, I'm, I'm a person who was born in the Middle East and they grew up for for a while in the Middle East. Uh, I used always to think about uh, European people as smart people. And I'm not, I don't want anyone to be feel like he's uh, offended if you are European. I know there's many people, they are wonderful people there. But sometimes I wonder, like, what's wrong with Europe? I mean, are you going to exchange your God? with a ball so for the sake of a ball you exchange i mean what kind of a muslim you will be you worship the ball so if tomorrow somebody is a hindu he make a goal you become a hindu i mean who in the world is going to marry this idiot you see i feel really sorry for women they get involved with men in such mentality and uh, sadly you know if you go and watch the news about uh, the the football game i mean in england people they are killing each other over it in france is the same in germany is the same people they, they have a god his name is a ball i mean what's wrong with those people i mean how in the world a man like that or you know he, he can have a family this guy he will exchange his wife for a goal what happened to this? I don't care really if he converted to Islam or not. Obviously, he's a garbage. But because if you if you are willing to change your religion, you know, like the Muslims, you see here, they are happy about this. They say, once again, Muhammad Salat had proved true inspiration for Liverpool fans who are declaring their respect for his faith in after each game. Mu Salah has made me become a Muslim. I mean, maybe become a Muslim. Okay. So if Salah tomorrow, he lose the game. They will leave Islam. Anyway, I mean, this is the stupidity of the Muslim, but this is not their fault. I, uh, you know, I always say, garbage in, garbage out. And I say to women, because those are men, you see that they say that men are smart and women are half a brain in Islam, right? Well, the men are the half a brain. Don't you see what's happening? People, they are killing each other over a ball. They lose their mind. You know, who is the half a brain? And who is the stupid woman is going to marry a Western UK man like this? Or a French man like this? Or a German man like I mean, what's wrong? This guy is going to be a father? I mean, if a donkey deserves to be deserve to be a father, this guy he deserved to be a father. And I I wonder why the Muslims are so proud about this. I mean, are you saying Muslims that this guy he is replacing the bowl with Allah, but still he worship the bowl because he is saying Allah for the bowl, not for the sake of Allah. I mean, how stupid even the Muslims to be proud about it and so to be happy about it. But, you know, this is the mentality for them. It's just about propaganda. So I wanted to share this uh, short video with you. And uh, as I always say, you know, garbage in, garbage out. So my advice for women who they are listening, that they say that you are half a brain. You are a half a brain if you get involved with people like this. If you marry a man, he worship a soccer ball because he will replace you for the sake of a ball. He will replace you for the sake of a game. This is what happened to people that are involved with drugs, gambling, um, whatever kind of addiction. Use your brain. Use 
your brain. Otherwise, you don't have one. Watch who you are associating with. If the people you are associating with, they are willing to replace everything they believe in for the sake of a ball or for the sake of a game or for the sake of a gambling, those are trashy, garbage people. Stay away from them. They will have like it's like a disease they can they can they can you know uh, spread their disease in you this is have nothing to do by the way with islam this is about the stupidity you know you know but, uh, uh, to be a muslim to be stupid guarantee you know yesterday i was explaining to the people in the in the seminar i mean how stupid is this god to to promise me to have a couch and to have a pillow and that's uh, each time i open the door on friday night you know uh, uh, allah will give me a shower of musk i mean this is stupid but this is the this is the mentality of the stupid people people don't want to see how stupid this is they don't want to see that a god he promised me uh, a sexual ability in heaven he is obviously focusing in my penis they don't want to see that he is focusing in my, my own desire he's trying to seduce me fool me it's like a you, you know you have a you have a rat and you want to kill that rat but what do you do so you have to sacrifice some cheese Allah he did not even need to sacrifice the cheese he promised you the cheese in the heaven but that cheese is fake and it's not exist those people they have a mental issue they are suffering from emptiness in their life so they try to replace their empty life with a bowl if the bowl is what going to make them full in their life what kind of life they have Ask yourself, leave your comment, and tell me what do you think about what you just heard. This is a Christian Prince with you, and I miss you, Abdul, and I see you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.